Good day, everybody. Welcome to today's video. In today's video, an Aubrey's 2017 Jetta. The problem is this headlights won't turn off. You can turn the switch to off and the headlights stay on. The only way to get around this for the time being until you fix it is to pull the light switch out and pull the wiring harness out from the back. That's the only way to turn the lights off until you can fix it. To remove the light switch, you push it in and turn to the right and then you can pull it out. And what you're going to see is that little knob on the side which locks it in place. Push it in, turn to the right and you can see it goes in. And that's how you remove it and install it. And the electric connection is just push a little tab back at the on the plug there and then pull it out. The dealership wanted over 200 bucks for a new light switch. So we got one off Amazon for $15. So we're going to see if this $15 light switch is going to work. With the uh, Volkswagen Jetta, you're either going to have the small plug or the large plug. So you're going to have to know what plug it is. So we just plugged in the cheap aftermarket light. And as you can see right there, Aubrey's having trouble getting it in. Because you have to push it in, turn it to the right to get that knob in. And then slide it in place and then lock it. You can see right there, done. So now with the light switch off, I'm going to do a walk around just to visually make sure that the lights are indeed off. Because if that didn't fix our problem, then there's obviously something else at hand. But considering since we were able to disconnect the plug and the light stayed off, that's how we ruled it out that the plug or the light switch was indeed faulty. So now going back inside his vehicle, going to turn his headlights on. And then do another walk around to make sure that indeed the lights are working as they should. And as you can see right there, the headlights are working. So quick $15 fix for a light switch. Got Aubrey back up and going so he didn't have to unplug his light switch every time he stopped his vehicle. I hope this quick and easy video will help some people out who may be suffering from the same issue. So if you have any questions or comments, post them below. And I'll see you guys in the next video.